Hello, it's Sandy, and I don't have any art for you today, but I do have some art being packed up. Yesterday, I put together some packages for Robin and Elizabeth, who both purchased some paintings. Thank you, thank you, thank you for investing in my work. I love sending my paintings out to somebody else, knowing that they're going to be displayed and loved or given as a gift. And it just warms my heart. It just makes me so happy. So thank you. And to everybody else who's been sharing so much love with me for the last few days since the superpower video, um, you guys have made a, a total difference, not just in the funds support and the people who have joined to support the DNTT fund, but those who have taken classes, those who have dropped a super thanks here in YouTube, and those who have told their stories. Hearing your stories helps me feel a little less alone, knowing that other people are going through their own crises. It reminds me of the day that my father passed away a couple decades ago. I remember going to the grocery store. I have no idea why I went to the grocery store that day, but I did. And it wasn't bawling or anything, so no one would have had any idea what was going on. But I remember the checkout clerk was just stupidly happy. <laughs> I just remember wanting to grab her by the collar and saying, don't you know the world just ended? She had no idea, of course, what I was going through. But it reminded me that every day we probably come into contact with somebody whose world ended. Somebody who just got bad news, got a diagnosis, heard about family with a diagnosis, lost a job, their house burned down. I mean, there's always going to be somebody in your path who had something happen that day. And it just makes me more sensitive at moments like those to to remember, you know, being in a rush behind somebody who's driving slow. Maybe they've got something really major going on. Worried about that mom who can't keep her kids from screaming. Who knows what's going on in the family? And it just makes me more compassionate for others. I, um, in addition to having my, my other things going on that I talked about, Previously, got some rather difficult family news yesterday as well. So when it rains, it pours, huh? It's things that happen to all of us. And remembering that we have community out there, we have people around us to support us, means the world. So make sure that those who you love know that you love them. Make sure they remember it. Make sure that uh, that they know how you feel about them. Write it in a card. Don't just stamp a sentiment. Write them a note. And tell them in your own handwriting what they mean to you. And that's my message for today. I'll see you guys Thursday and Friday. Little treat. A couple of card videos. I'm in a few hops. So I'll see you then. Take care and go create something because right now I'm not really feeling like it. I'd like to know somebody else is. All right. Bye-bye.